Boy, da. Konnichiwa, tubers of YouTube. Hey, nice one. The fuck it wasn't. Stand all morning, isn't it? Yes, I am, pretty enough. Alright. So, guys, uh, this is not a recap. It is a Q&A session with Metropolis 86 and... Me. And him. <laughs> well, first of all, thank you for all your questions. We appreciate it. Those who didn't ask a question, leave now. Leave. No, I'm joking. You can stay. It's fine. We want to use. All right. Oh. Yeah, you didn't ask a question. No, I was going to ask you one, actually. I don't know. What was it? Can you see my soul with MP bus? <laughs> How's it feel being a dwarf? We find out now. <laughs> <laughs> right, so um, we've got the questions printed off. And we've yes. actually some answers on you. Oh, yeah, I've got some answers. Right, well, first off. It's Dave, I'm a game geek. We'll think of some in chops. And he never did. I never did. He never did. Dave. So, um, never did. Our first question is from Retro Reclaimer. Yes. That is Kieran. If you haven't checked out his channel, go check him out. Down to Earth Guy. To both of you, what is the best item in your collection? Do you want to go first? Yeah, I'll go first because you've got a better one to me. Um, <laughs> to me, it's. I want nothing really spectacular in my item. I don't know what you're going to say. <laughs> in my collection, but to me, it's going to be. Well, it's two actually. It's the original and the sequel. It's Wonder Boy and Wonder Boy Monsterland. <laughs> Can't really separate between them two. Wonder Boy was the game that got me into gaming and still got me up now. Wonder Boy and Monsterland is my favourite game. Of all time. Not a day goes by where he doesn't mention it. No, exactly. We even got a fridge magnet to this. I see it every day. Mm. That was kindly sent me off Herbie Arsenal Rose M. Ian. Well, cheers. For me, I didn't really know what to pick my be the best item in my collection, but last year at Comic Con, I picked up a copy of DuckTales 2 on the NES, and it is supposed to be quite rare. So, it is quite I love the hard, original yeah. DuckTales game. I had that, so I thought I'd pick it up. And I'd say that is the best item in my collection. Well, one of the best. I can't say it's the best, do you know what I mean? I just can't dedicate something. I can have to best well, favourite. the question is, what is the best item in your collection? I know, but come you on. You can't say it's the best item, you can't say it's the best. Anyway, should we move on? Dictals 2 Cheers for your question. Right, the next question is to me. <laughs> oh, yes, of my good mate, who we asked, Double O Seven. Matt. Is Steve as short in real life as he looks on video? Yes. Yes. Because actually, I am now I'm standing up and Matt is kneeling down. <laughs> it's true, it's true. Yes. Absolutely. I have no legs. <laughs> I'm just from the waist down. Just <laughs> 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 <It's> a pair <laughs> of legs walking around. <laughs> down. Um, to both of you, what is your earliest gaming memory? Ooh, mine, I know mine. Can I go first? This one yeah, okay. first. Uh, mine is on the Commodore 64 playing a game called called Flambeau's Crest. I actually did a gameplay video of this quite some months ago. Um, basically, it didn't come on a cassette tape. It was on a cartridge you put in the back of the Commodore, so it'd load up straight away, and like all the other cassettes, which sometimes would not load up. Yeah, that was my old legs. I never... Basically, the aim of the game is a side scrolling thing. You had to go and hunt monsters. Um, it would show you a picture of the monster you had to hunt at the bottom of the screen. And you'd go through the level looking for the flashing monster of the same type, kill it, collect a heart or something like that, a scroll, and then take it back to your hut. Then you get more and more until you kill all of them, and then you advance. That's my earliest game memory. Well Boom. done, well done. What's yours? <laughs> Last <Bye>. week. <laughs> <laughs> Mine is, um, I got my, I must be about five or six. Went down to fish shop with my old girl, my mother, for jogging local chippy. We used to have loads of games. When we was a kid, but when we first went, it was a different owner. Yeah. And I'm just waiting in the thing, and I just looked over. I seen this game, and Jungle, Jungle Hut. Jungle Hut. <coughs> and I remember, I was saying, saying, like, oh, can I have some money to have a go on it? And to keep me off, I work, because the queue was quite big. So just give me 20 pence, I think it was, to go on and play on it. And then a few more 20 pence later, I was still playing on it, and she was stood behind me waiting with the food. If you want. Uh, yes, I think she had to prime me from the fucking uh, <laughs> the game again. Go to yeah. film week. Yeah, so playing Jungle Hunt, um, the arcade one. My local chip is my earliest memory in about 90, like 85 or 86. Not bad, not bad. So quite a long time ago. I think I was three or four when I did mine. Five maybe, I don't know, I can't remember. So I shouldn't have said that because it's the earliest no. game memory. Yes, exactly. 
Right, smug bug. Do you want to read this one out? I like the idea of getting the... Oh, oh right. THSC. <laughs> <laughs> right, to do the recap. Right. So that's not really a question there, right? No. The question is... It's those spinners. Who has a stronger accent? You or Steve? So that's you or me. Right. I, I, I didn't <laughs> sign up at all. <laughs> Oh, I, I, right, it's, it's hard to answer it because we spoke about this the other day. Didn't we were speaking about this in Cafe. We went to buy some more games. Yes. Um, to me, I don't sound Welsh. Same as me. We just. You were hearing different than what we were. And like, yeah. you know, if I watch a video and I hear my voice on it, yeah. sometimes I can hear something, but yeah. other times, more often or not, it's just me, if you know what I mean. I do know some people sound really Welshy. But then when I speak to English people, they do tell me I do some Welsh. Yeah. I have yeah. been told you scored football two years ago. Oh, you've got to go to Brampton. Right. Before I'd be here, we're getting like a play. Ooh. And John, this girl one day, and she turned around and said, I've got the strongest Welsh accent I've heard. But to me, yes. Okay, as a default, we'll see him for that then. No. Because I have <laughs> never had that said to me. <laughs> but yeah, we don't really... Sound Welsh in not to each other anyway. No, Swahili, I'd say, but not so much. Are you happy with the way the high score challenge group has grown? Yes. Yeah, absolutely. It's been we bought this, wasn't it? We, I still remember. We started using it. I just what it was two years ago, was it or something like that? Two Christmas ago, my wife now bought me a a modded Xbox Christmas. Yeah, because I she knew I was already into retro games, and she thought instead of having. Piles and piles of games around, which piles. I have got games around anyway. But that's just for that all in one place, job done. Yeah. And I was playing it, playing it, playing it, and I kept buying on about it, too, didn't I? You nagged me for months and months, so I finally yeah, caved in. I got one last year sometime, just after Christmas. Yeah. After Christmas? Was there, we were just chatting with me and said, oh, yeah, we should do like a. A challenge against each other on YouTube. Yeah. Because Steve kept saying to me, Oh, I'm in touch with all these cool gamers now. Go check out the channels, Matt. Go on YouTube, Matt. I was like, I am on YouTube. I done like one video. Yeah. Two videos. I was like, yeah. I was like, I was into my blog, so I didn't really want to do YouTube. In my earlier videos, you see me say, I'll always do more on my blog than I will make videos. Yeah. Now it's, it's the yeah, complete it's opposite. Flop now, won't it? So yeah, we um, decided to challenge each other on. Thunderdrama tool. Yeah. Yeah. Because I remember how we did it. I wrote, I wrote, was it five or six games down? Yeah. Put them down, basically put them in my hand and marked one, one. And it was Thunder Dragon 2. So, um, Luke smiles at Sinji987, saw a video. Chuckles, as he's like, Chuckles. He wanted to join in. He, so he did a run as well. Then, I think we had Chris Hack, Colin, Russ, yeah. Oddie, they were the only ones, Tom Tom. Yeah. Um, seemed to just. Seemed to expand it. There was another. Yeah, another someone entry. else would join in. So Steve created a group then on Facebook. Yeah. Right. He made me admin. Which Matthew basically runs it because I'm fucking all plus at doing stuff like that. Yeah, you just stick to the game stack list, I'll do the rest. Yeah. <laughs> um, and we now well, we've gone from like two or three at the, at the very beginning to 73 members, I think, yeah. last time I checked. That's awesome. And I think the good thing is with most game picks, there's always around 15 to 20 people yeah. play it, don't they? Um, which is good to ask, we want a bit of fun. And some people in the group are waiting to get modded Xboxes. Yeah. And if you're just in the group to watch us, that's absolutely fine. Yeah, exactly, Still, yeah. You know, that's I like cool that. I like the banter in the group as well. Yeah. Yeah, fair play. And go on, thank you Russell for the eggs. <laughs> we really enjoyed that. <laughs> Actually, speaking of Russ, before we do know Bugs last question, Russ asked me on Facebook last night, have you ever considered spelling your name with two T's? Absolutely not. That is right. blasphemy. S T T. E P H E N. Got a few T's in Stephen. And me, he meant as well. But I thought Russ was quite intelligent. <laughs> Never mind. <laughs> no. It's okay, we've had a few minutes, then it's fine. Yes. <laughs> oh, Russ, we'll have to send us your address. Yeah, sorry, yeah, so I'm we can send you the letter back. <laughs> so, <laughs> Bugs, first cre third question Do you secretly hope Sean loses it sometimes? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> no, well, in fairness, yeah, he he's, he's probably won the most, but he has lost it quite a few times because we've had... Well, I can't really say lose it. No, not, say obviously it. he hasn't lost, you know what I mean, but we've had Johnny Hart, Ollie, Tom Tom, Gary, they've all come first. Yeah. Nova Bug. 
So we've had a you might come down. first at the start. I've never come first, I've come second by highest. Uh, women love you. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, and my wife wish she could say the same about me. <laughs> <laughs> oh yes. Right. Oh. Next one, is it? Yes. Is that it? Once a month. Might be four. Oh, yeah, go on to the next right. one. That's me. Right, JL76. That one by there. Because right. that's just chit chat between right. us. Let's see how you can tell I'm not the brightest. What is your favourite ice score challenge so far? Ooh. Do you want to go or do you want me to go? Went first last time. Yeah, same as me. Yeah. All, All the lights. One, two, let's just go, go, go. Go, go. Where do you want me to go? Right. <sighs> um, favourite. Also, there have been a lot, a lot of good games. They have. And some. Not so good. Yeah. <laughs> yes, yeah. <laughs> but, uh, yeah, one, I do go back now and again. I play quite a few of them, but one, I play quite regular. Now, and I do really enjoy it. And that was Tony's pick, Time Pilot. Ooh, mm, not bad. I do, I really like that. That was a good game. Do you, well, my daughter is not that bad on it, actually. Didn't your daughter beat that? some people in the charge actually yes yeah, so when she done it i thought oh <laughs> <laughs> yeah. but um, uh yeah she uh is she yeah that's the game i think <laughs> and i enjoyed the most i think enjoy the most yeah awesome right so mine i can say bubble bubble because it brought back childhood memories and we had a tournament once in a local pub in my local village uh, kids village. birthday party. The only game in the village. Oh gosh. <laughs> Not really long, don't I? Kids birthday party, my friend's birthday party, and I think if you won, you won a, ba a bag of marbles. Oh, so it brought back memories of that because it's the second time I played in a tournament. Yeah. So yeah, and that's one of my earliest games as well after Flimbo's Quest. So Bubble Bubble, that was picked by Monkey Spaz 5000. So, so two marvellous. How old were you both when you first played your first video game? Computer and what was it? Well, I think we covered this, didn't we? Yeah. The first one. That, that was my was Jungle Hunt. Mine was Flavor's Quest. And, but if we say the next one, or perhaps we go console. If we go console, say first console one. Or console's Commodore say, 64 for oh, me. Oh yeah, shit with me. It was arcade this or yeah. the, was it the first <laughs> one I can remember. So my uncle was quite young. So we lived with my nan growing up. So I'm not a bar divorce now, blah de blah. Um, my uncle was He's 12 or 13 years older than me. Nice. So, like I said, when I was growing up, I was like playing on his Atari and stuff like that. But I think my first one, what was it? I'm sure it was. It was either Kaboom or like Galaxian. Galaxian. It was something like that. No, Galaxian was the first game, sorry, I ever bought for myself. Oh, right. Out of the first game I ever. No, that's physically impression. myself. That's, that's and the impression. Yeah. That's the first game I've stuff. Yeah. It was out of birthday money or something like that, I think. Uh, but yeah, I think it was like Kaboom or something like that. Yeah, so cool. then we had the panels on the Atari. Right. It was like Atari 2600 Junior. Mm. I think. So I remember I had that off him. After I'd asked us, yeah, we're going to go. That's not bad. Yeah. Much better than tonight, I had to call us four. What's each of your favourite video game characters? Ooh, mm. mine's quite easy, mm. mine, isn't it? Wonder Boy? Yeah. Right, this one I struggle on because I got oh, one. What do you think of the name, innit? I think. Just to let you all know, there is a new Wonder Boy game coming out. I know it's coming out on PS4. Ooh. I think it's on Steam and that. It is Monster Boy. It's something to do with the drunken, drunken wizard or something Monster, like that. Monster Boy and the drunken yob. <laughs> no, but it's something like, oh, something to do with drunken. Yeah, have a look at it. It looks quite good, really. Okay, for me, I'm going to say Murray the Demonic Talking Skull from Curse of Monkey Island. I'd I think he's awesome. He's just a sarcastic skeleton and dead thing got his head blown off and he's, he appears all the time then throughout the game. It's awesome. Oh. Try and take over the world, but he's just a talking skull. Oh. Skull, so. oh, I like his question. What's the one game you wish there would be a sequel to, but no, there isn't likely to be one? Right, I know there's not going to be a sequel to it. And in fact, it's well, not even on port to it. It's an arcade game, I think. Whoever played it, can all say how good the game is. Yes. But there'll never be a sequel to it because there was never a sequel to the film. And that's Willow. Uh, Capcom. Right, Capcom. Right, I got you, I got you. No, there was a Willow on, your, on the Nintendo, but it was a totally different game to the arcade. And obviously, for like. Yeah. I really know how to answer this one. I, okay. 
I don't know what I wish it'd be a sequel to. I w- I'd like to see another Monkey Island, but like, you know, a proper I want, Monkey Island. I want sequel. It's want had sequel. sequels, but I want to see another I one again. I want sequel, did not it? I mean, t- um, Telltale Games, they did a Tales of Monkey Island episode series last time, a few years back, but it wasn't as good. I've got another answer as well. So I'd like to see, officially, Monkey Island 5. And, you know, original creators of all of them. Do it right, man, do it right. Oh, another one I'm going to sneak in as well as a second one. Bullet Storm. Oh, yes. Love Bullet Storm yes. on a 360. Yes. I've got a PS3, of course. I agree, though, I agree. Okay. Shall I tell you this one? Yep, go for it. Tori Electric Adventures. Your favourite system that you had back in the day. <laughs> Mine's easy. I'm going to answer yours for you. Sega Master System. Spot on. Right. For myself, I will say... I was torn between Mega Drive and NES. But I'm going to say NES because it was my first console that I actually knew what I was doing. Yeah. So I had Super Mario Bros. I had a lot of my favourite cartoons as games, video games on it. So I just loved it all. So yeah, I'm going to say NES. Yeah. Or um, NES to some people, but it's always NES to me. Ish. And your favourite system, retro or modern now? Let's just... My favourite retro system now is still the mass system. My favourite modern console, and I love it, is the console that got me back into gaming, and that was the Xbox 360. Mm. I actually love the 360. Xbox 360. I'm going to say... Just kind of probably part of the Gears of War series. So I really can't answer this one. I don't think I got a favourite. I do buy mostly PlayStation games and stuff, so maybe I'd have to go for... PS3, I'd say. PS3, PS4, I'd have to say one of those. Yeah. As modern. Retro, would still be the NES, I guess, yeah. See now, I did the Wii down well, I thought. It's not my favourite, but it'd probably be... I'd put the, the Wii in front of the PS3. The rooms. <laughs> Is it? <laughs> I should get it. <laughs> All right then. Uh, oh, Two T's has got a question. That's Happy Martin. To Matt. Oh, that's just Matt. Oh, well. <laughs> Besides the Mario Kart franchise, what is your favourite racing game or series? Any system, any era, any racing style. Well, you can answer this one first, then. Yes. Uh, well, actually, this might surprise you, but I'm not a huge racing fan of oh, racing fan games. I enjoy them. I won't go to my way to actually buy them, though. And But I do enjoy them. I do enjoy Mario Kart. Um, I do enjoy Mario Kart. And I... I don't know. See, I'm, Mario Kart? <laughs> Those are Mario Kart games. No, but one series, one single game I did like, Thanks to this guy nagged me about it. it was blue on the PS3. Which is like a picture of Need for Speed on Mario Kart. Yeah, it's very similar to Mario Kart. Because you like all your pickups and you can yeah. fire them. I thought that was awesome. And I, I, can, I come first place quite a lot on that, so that's yeah. why I like it. You probably but, like music, I can't come first. But I will try all Star Sega Sonic Transform. Sega What's it all called? Star Racing. Thank you. Sega and Sonic All Star Racing. But the first one I'd say is better than the second. Right. The first one is fucking fantastic. Right. But the second one is still good. Cool. Because everyone's going on me to get that. First one, you get on PS3. PS3. Not through the new one. I could get on PS4. Then you get on the Wii U, the Transformed. But to me, the first one is better than the second. Cool. Right. Do you want to answer that as well? Yeah. Right. My favourite racing game series. Like I said, Matt said, uh, obviously, Blur. Blur. Right. I, mean, I love Blur. Blur, Blur. I really like oh, the Blur. Um, Need for Speed series. Really like honest I have played some of The best one I've played still is still the first Underground. Need for Speed Underground. Yeah. I had it on the original Xbox. Still got it now. I love that. Need game. for Speed Underground. But probably. Yeah. Need for Speed Odd Pursuit. Right. I love that game. I got it. I haven't played it yet. It's awesome, but awesome. Right. So, Johnny Hart wanted an arm wrestle between us. However. Well, we've done it. Did we? Yes, we've done it. Oh, right. Let's see. Let's see. Let's see. Right, you wanted an arm wrestle, but we can't do that because the camera's up there, the floor's down there. We can do a punching contest. I'll probably use that one as well. Right, so we do have a. We were going to do a staring contest, but we don't know who would win that one. <laughs> exactly. <laughs> I win. <laughs> Right, and then we got a question from Retro Gaming Wales. Mark. Who is Mark Edwards? Who changed yeah. his name recently? What 
my feelings when when you guys invite me to Pontypridd or wherever you live. It's not Pontypridd. Oh no, perhaps you are invited. Right. Perhaps you should get why the fuck are you invited? Why are you guys inviting me? <laughs> we haven't invited you. <laughs> <laughs> you're on a bodyguard, or you don't think they're fucking. For some ass been on some games. Yeah. Well, my answer is when you promise there will be cake. Easily please, but no, easily please. Yeah, also, I've seen the mark, but we can tell the policy until next level games for ages. Right. But it's really awkward for me on the weekends because of all my missus works. And you work she, works she works in a cancer hospital. <laughs> so uh, she does it because of the kids. She tries to get a lot of her shifts, so it's nights or on the weekends. Cool. So it's, it's hard and not cool. You yeah. Obviously, you need work all life balance sort of thing. Yeah. But yeah, we definitely got to sort something out, Mark. Cool. Yeah, definitely. I shall join you. Definitely. Right, now we've got some action. Half five, and we're not playing a fucking virtual racing. No. I've seen that. Yes. Right, we've got some extra questions now that I wrote them from the YouTube group. Johnny Hart, will Wales ever lead to the high score challenge again? Now, if you mean lead, as in. Come talk, I think he means. Yeah, that's what I think he means, not yeah. in control of the group. Um, oh. Ex Mosquito. Yes. As well. I think kick all your asses. Yes, come on, Mark, get in the group, help us out. So, yeah, I'm saying. Yes. Well, he is in the group, but do some videos. Yes. But we all seem like us talking about life and that. Well, you know. And a Street Fighter 2 video you put up. Have you seen yeah. that yet? Oh, so I think fantastic. we've proven the Welsh people can be fantastic. Yeah. Just not us two. Because he's too short. Yes, exactly. Any future plans for your group and channels? Well, just keep going away. Carry on as it's going, I guess. Yeah. yeah. Doing another tournament this year, hopefully. Hopefully, I'll uh, run better. Start doing some more pickup videos and stuff like that. I don't know, well, when the boot sale, because I need the one boot sale really got wrong, my ass. He's had a trade video on hold for weeks. Come on. I know. I'm going to pick up, <laughs> pick up video. I've got a few ideas for my yeah. channel, yes. It's still waiting for my game to come back for all the friends' birthday. Yeah. Um, I might look again some proper editing software and try and something fancy one day, but I just like doing... I want to do fucking lazy to up. I just check the camera there, sit down. I'd love to be able to do it. I'd love to have time to do it. Speaking of time, 20 minutes so far. Well, hey, nah. that's gone fast. And the people looking, thinking, what the fuck are you pointing at? They're probably looking behind now, thinking, oh, I can see my clock. <laughs> fuck is it in the house? It's going to be a clock then. <laughs> it had to be you to think that. What was the tone of the conversation? Oh, what about a recap yesterday? You and know. I'm not going to go next. <laughs> right, a friend of mine called Jay, if you could go back and tell your younger self something, what would it be? Oh, I think you're honest. You told me earlier, answer it. <laughs> right. Can't you say answer or should I answer? Go. Right. I tell myself to tell my mother to get my fucking email figures and mask figures and Star Wars and Transformers and every other fucking figure I had out of the attic before we left when we moved. That happened to my dad. I got it. He left all his like old toys over a friend's house because they used to play together with their best friends. Yeah. But when they moved, they left the stuff there and someone else has had it and it's gone now. It's just... Yeah. Because I have started buying back some email figures. Yeah. But they're still not the same as all the ones you had as a kid. I know. I'm trying to get e man. It's hard work. To get yeah. for the time. You try and get e man, no complete with stuff for the price. So, what I might do, I might, I might just buy him just, or if I see my boots, I'll just all loose, just a figure, do that, and then just buy the accessories as a thing. Cool. Well, I'd have a lot of time to think about this. So, if I went back like a couple of years ago, I tell myself to buy a modded Xbox sooner and get on YouTube sooner because yeah. I really enjoy doing this. Yeah. It's great. Oh. <laughs> and I tell myself, don't do it with Steve. <laughs> so, Play games, Chuckles, yes, Chuckles <laughs> is now asked, do you two actually work in our building or do you just break in to do the recaps? We actually just break in to do the recaps. Right. Because our last one to tell you, it is an abandoned office. Yeah. You've still belong to it. See what I look, see? There's a Fuck all India. Yeah. But apart from now, a couple of boxes on there, which whoever's coming in here now. However, we don't break in, they left the door and yeah. locked. So we just walk in. Our office is right over there. Yeah. <laughs> if people open the blinds, they can actually see us. Yeah. But they don't. The <laughs> and they think, what the fuck are them two bastards doing? Yeah. Some people have given us weird looks when you've just walked yes. into an abandoned office saying, what are you doing? What are you doing? So that's what you think we. No, I do. You can use your imagination what they think we're doing. Dirty fuckers. Yes. And then Lucas asked, right? Okay, this is weird. If you could change your hair colour, what well, you have left, well, I have left, <laughs> all over for life, what colour would you pick? And he means all over. Oh, all over. I have no idea. I don't know. 
Well, it's obviously got to be thrown black on blonde, right? I quite finger. I don't know why, right? No, as soon as I do it, I finger ginger. Don't ask me why, right? It's, didn't see that one coming. No, so it's just ginger. Yeah, I don't know, not saying I want, but that was the first word. If I get spider the wine, I. Okay. I'm going to go for blonde, I'd say. Because when I was born, I did actually have blonde hair. You know, the baby had blonde hair. And I've had blonde, blonde I've had, I used to have blonde highlights when I used to have a lot of hair. What the hell happened to her? Did some more just come out there? <laughs> I'm saying that, I can't see anything. Why are you talking that? I want uh, Chuckles to answer that question himself as well. Right, and this is off my cousin Gareth. What are you hoping to see and get from Comic Con next month? Well, Gareth, I am hoping to find some rare games, some cool collectible figures. I want to have my photo in a DeLorean, and I just want to find something that, you know, something really cool I've never seen before. And I want to see you because you're supposed to be coming down for it. So, yeah. Can I answer that? Gareth, I'm not going. No. So, uh, I'm not going. My cousin, right? But I hope he gets me some mass system stuff for you today. I know, I know. My cousin, right? He always finds these random weird songs and he'll sing them constantly to me and I get them stuck in my head. I've had one song stuck in my head since August. First weekend in August of last right, year. I think he's building up to sing us a little song. No, it's the pineapple song. <laughs> go on, let it go. Um, I'm growing pineapple, a juicy pineapple. That's all, that's all I know. It's the McDonald's advert, but it's stuck in my head. All because of you. So the rules are, you come down, there's no pineapple song. I'm glad I'm not going to call my call. <laughs> this is going to take ages to upload, by the way. <laughs> I'm glad you were uploading it or not. I'm going to do it overnight, just keep my laptop on. Yes. Why would you like to start to do? That's it, Ad. I can't decide I'm getting on the internet. I need some fibre optic. Yes, I got fibre optic now because we're still so far away from the exchange. Yeah. That's it, I said I'll rock better than what I was at. Right? What was the video we done yesterday? It was 30 minutes. It's my longest video. And 30 minutes, I think it took me just under an hour and a half to upload. Which is good for me because before that would have took me. What the hell is this going to take then? I don't know, I don't care, you were uploading it. I've got to leave on for days. <laughs> right then, guys, I think we're done. Yeah, thank you for your questions and we shall see you again soon. Oh, we have Sorry. got a question for you, Lot. We know Ollie Martin now, cheers all, is doing the WrestleFest recap as he picked the game. Yes. So we, if people don't want to do it, they don't have to, but we figured if whoever yeah. picks a game, if they do the recap, and yeah. that's all it is, is. Indeed, I agree. So I can just read the scores, basically. And if you don't want to do it, if you're that thingy against it, one of us will do it. Yeah, exactly. Or we might even meet up and do it. Yeah, we're going to try and meet up once a month, you know. Even if everyone does it, it's no thing that they pick. Oh, so whoever picks the game, if they do the recap, we we'll still meet up like once a month and just have a chat and yeah, talk, about stuff, and yeah. talk about what we thought one month. This is games. Yeah. Yeah. Right, that's, that's done, I think, guys. Right. Thank you for watching. See you soon, Cheers the proper nights. Motherfuckers. <laughs> Bye.